Hey there, YouTube. Jack Lair here. Uh, just a real quick video. Uh, I got some gameplay footage of one of the greatest arcade games that I've played in a really long time, even though it's an old arcade game. came out in uh, 1998 by Namco, uh, and it's called Gun... What the hell is it called? Gunmen Wars. And my sons and I sat and played it for a good long while. And I finally decided to take a video of it just because I had never seen it before. And this may be the first arcade cabinet that I have to get just because it is that awesome of a game. Here, here's the footage. Okay, these are two cabinets side by side. There are three different levels that you can choose. There it is, Gunmen Wars. And it's got cameras built in that take the pictures of who you are. So we've got my son on one side, my son on the other. There's the camera up there. Now it doesn't work in low light when they had the disco ball going on here. Uh, it wasn't working. Now you can see that your pictures were on the ID tags of the people that get locked in there. And basically it's a overgrown paintball match. I'll kind of focus in on one side. I also help my son play here, so if the field kind of wanders there, that's why. But essentially what you saw there is we take one of the guys down and these little gems pop out of them. Now those are the points somehow. Now what you can see is you can see uh, the pictures are getting bigger over on the red side. That means we have more of the, the, the points or whatever. And then the health bar is down there at the bottom. Now if the health bar gets down to zero, the little gems pop out and either your team has to retrieve them or the other team gets them back. Now. Uh, as you can see, we just died on this side. But you see that auto three? He's got the most points. So that's the guy that we want to kill so that he'll drop the points and then we can pick them up. See, we kill him, we take the points, and he falls out of the lead. Now somebody else is in the lead, we kill him, take his stuff, we get more points. Now there is friendly fire in the game. Uh, it doesn't seem to do a whole lot of damage, but then again, I was always kind of hanging back, just trying to pick up the, the points. The good thing is that the AI does actually avoid you, so let's say if you don't have that many points, they will run past you to get to me as all the points. Now, what my sons and I figured out is this pretty simple AI, so you just wait for the other person to run by you, and then you shoot him in the back over and over again. Now here's what it's going to show. Is it's going to show a history of the game. It's going to show the point totals. And then it's going to show you how the game, who got the highest score. And then it's going to show you how the game progressed for you. When you had the most points, any death resets it. And then it goes back up. This is an amazing game. And the controls, see the guns there? Let me explain how those work, because that's pretty cool in addition to that. So here's how the control works. You've got this gun. Hang on. For demonstration purposes. So you've got this gun, and it's sitting there mounted at the screen. Now, you aim it around to shoot. But when you push forward, your little dude walks forward. When you pull back, he runs backwards. When you push left, he runs, so on and so forth. He strafes. Now when you turn like this, when you turn the gun a little, he, you just kind of aim. When you turn it all the way, your dude actually rotates. How friggin' cool is that? Genius. I love this game. I want this game. Unfortunately, this is the first time I've ever heard of it. So, ah. now, uh, this may be some secret that it's the greatest game ever that I've just never heard of. So, please, 
enlighten me. Tell me if you have stories, if you've seen this game. Now, I saw it at uh, mid City Skateland here in the DFW Texas area. So, if you want to take a look at this game, if this game looks like the kind of game that you're into, that you would have a blast with, by all means, go there and play it. I... I wish that this was out. I, if I could even think of a way to emulate this, I would love to play it at home. Sadly, I can't even think of how to mount mount a gun onto something to move it around like that. To, I, I don't know how to do it. Wouldn't even know where to begin. So, anyways... As always, find one of these games and play on.